Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cindy and today I have a Chanel unboxing for you. And um, it's been a long time since I bought a brand new Chanel bag from, from the Chanel boutique. I've gotten a lot of my classic flap bags through the vintage market. I haven't bought a new Chanel bag directly from the boutique in a while. And then with this recent huge price increase at Chanel, I don't anticipate buying <laughs> another new Chanel, at least not a classic flap anytime soon. Uh, but I did buy a new bag. We'll go ahead and show it. This is the dust bag. I got a Chanel Deauville. All right, the color's kind of getting washed out a little bit, but I got the small uh, Deauville in the beige color. As far as luxury designers, I don't have anything in this light color because you know, obviously it's a little kind of scary to have kind of a light colored bag. But uh, yeah, this is, I have the tag here still attached. This is from the 20P collection. There's a tag, it's called beige. The descriptions are so vague online. They literally, it's just called shopping bag. What's funny is this is called large shopping bag, but in my opinion, I would call this the small. And then if you look at the larger size, which has the top handle, that's just called shopping bag and it just says uh you know and they're both called beige although here they call it gold gold m so maybe medium i love this i love the stripes it kind of has you know a little interesting texture i was a little worried because i thought it would just be straight up kind of uncoated untreated canvas but if you feel it in person it has like a protective coating it feels a little bit like raffia i do plan on spraying scotch guard I was debating whether to get the small or the large and whether to get this beige or a darker color. I posted a recent uh, bags I regret selling and I actually owned the Chanel Deauville tote bag and I think it was the extra large. It was very big. It was like the dark denim um, blue navy and then the Chanel logo was in white and it had the top handles but it was just so big but what I love about this they redid the straps of the Deauville and if you look now, the chain strap um, has a has a leather center. So the leather, you know, flat leather strap part is what will be resting on your shoulder. So it won't be as heavy. And that was one of the primary reasons that I sold my bag. I ended up selling it because it was so uncomfortable. It was so heavy and it was painful <laughs> to carry um, in the large size. Uh, the other reason I got the small is because I have tons of huge tote bags. I did another recent video comparing all my recent kind of book tote style bags. I have the LV on the go GM tote bag. I have the Dior large book tote and the Rive Gauche tote. And so I just wanted, I just wanted a smaller, I just wanted a smaller bag. This is so lightweight. So again, the Deville is really light. It's very light and even in the large size, it's pretty light, but the, the smaller size is just like, it feels like nothing. Another change I noticed is the, the chains, you know, they kind of feed through the bag here, but what they changed is this used to be a, t like a T bar. And that was what held the chain strap from being pulled through. They changed it and I really like the change. Um, they changed it to this kind of a, of a medallion that has the double C. And it's, so it's really pretty, so it stops, you know, the chain from going through. I love the beige. The logo is, you know, is a darker brown, like a medium, maybe like a camel brown. Um, this leather handle is the same matching color. It has a snap in the middle. It's hard to hold because there's no shape to the bag. That's it, it's very small, but I like that it's a darker uh, brown interior. It has two slip pockets on one side and then it has this zip pocket that runs across the back. Here are the tags and the uh, authenticity card. With the recent price increase, the DeVille did not increase. <laughs> so this is the same price. The larger size has a kind of a water bottle um, it's not a pocket because it, it's really just a band on the side where you can slip a water bottle and then it will prevent it from, you know, rattling around your bag. But it's not a pocket because the, it goes right through it. That's the inside. This is the back. There's the bottom. So yeah, I definitely plan on applying Scotch Guard to this because it's such a light color. Okay, so here are a couple mod shots for you. Well, I love that they changed the straps because now this 
isn't digging into my shoulder, whereas before it, this was all just, a, you know, chain straps and it was so painful. But now it's a lot more comfortable. So I usually, with any bag that has two shoulder straps, I tuck the outside strap underneath the inside one so that the, you know, the outside strap isn't kind of falling off my shoulder. I am five feet tall. I'm standing on my tippy toes. Um, but yeah, with the shoulder strap, this hits about below my hips. I'll include pictures of when I tried the larger size I do like the larger size. I like the other colors. This is better for me because I already have so many larger totes. I really just needed something a little, just a little smaller just for every day. And the other reason that I didn't get the darker color, one of my YouTuber friends, Irene from Be Fabulous With Me, Irene, she had a darker colored Chanel also. And within three months, every single corner of the bag was got worn away and you could see the white kind of like piping underneath and it just looked so bad <laughs> it looked it was get it got frayed really easily and so with a lighter color bag i don't think you know it won't be the wear won't be as obvious that was my biggest concern with getting a darker color bag again um and was also one of the reasons why i sold my denim xl deville years ago my most recent luxury wish list check-in video I mentioned that I added the Deauville onto my list, but at that point I wasn't sure which which one I would go with. So ultimately I did decide on getting the smaller one because I don't have anything like this in my collection. I don't have a, this color or really kind of this size. But this is it up close. Yeah, I really like this little variation of the stripes. I don't have any striped bags in my collection. I love that this is darker. So even if this gets some wear at the top, it won't be as obvious because it has again the leather strap it won't be the you know chains won't be digging and pinching into my arm the way the older style did i was debating whether to add this <laughs> this little pearl chain um it's a little pearl charm this is from uh an etsy seller i'll link her info below but i added this i've had this on my um lv on the go tote for a long time but i don't know i just thought this would be really cute so let me just so i just added this pearl charm um you know it's a little extra but it adds a little, I just thought it kind of goes with the lighter color. Maybe it doesn't go, maybe it's too much, but I don't know, I'll leave it for now. So I went ahead and inserted the Samorga uh, small Dior book tote bag organizer into this Chanel Deville. They do make a Chanel Deville um, bag organizer. I'm not sure if it has a zip top, but I, this I had this from, you know, from before. And this has a zipper opening. And so you can see it really, it doesn't fit, it really doesn't fit. <laughs> Um, you can remove the top part, um, but the sides are kind of folded in a little bit, which, you know, is, is fine because it's felt, but then it does kind of take away from what you can store inside. Just to show you what it looks like inside. Now, this does have a water bottle pocket on the side, and it, and the color even matches, so I might, I might just use this because it does help it retain shape because this is a very unstructured kind of a tote bag. So if I'm traveling with this, um, I can use the organizer to zip the, the top close. And that's what it looks like closed. So then you don't have to worry about it being open. So that is my new Chanel Deville tote. Um, let me know if you have this and if you do use a bag organizer inside, if you decorate it with any charms or if you added these kind of pearl handles. So I'm hoping to get a lot of use out of this in the summer. Um, it's such a great color. It goes with so many things. And I do plan on um, applying Scotch Guard to it. So I can do a separate video showing you how to do that. But I've done it with so many of my other canvas bags. I've done it to my Louis Vuitton multi Shed accessory strap because it's a light pink and it looks perfect. So I finally checked this off my wish list. Let me know what you think of this design, this color, maybe these little pearls. Maybe, maybe it's too much, but whatever. That's my new Chanel Deville tote. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.